Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Yorkshire Crafter. My name's Julie and today we have got the Crafty Planner. So my June plans, so my plan, my stitching plans for June. So we have the whip go numbers and I have recently seen this morning we have the word for the acrostic for the 24 hours uh, cross stitch Facebook group they have an acrostic word each month sorry a sip of coffee right so let's get planning for June so today is Thursday the 1st of June so we normally put the acrostics in uh, not the acrostics the whip go for the first two weeks so today we need to put the first whip go number which was number four so number four for me is random two so let me just have a look how did i put this in yeah i put the numbers in sorry i'm all discombobulated so Let's have a look, which we're going to do this time. We will go for these bold ones. So we need a number four. So let's find a number four. And we've got the numbers here. So we have, whoops. And it don't want to come off. So we have the number four, and that is random two. So let's write that in. So random two. And as I have previously mentioned, when a randoms get picked either one or two i'm just going to pick random projects but since then i have been thinking about pulling my full coverages so i have got mini evergreen uh, uh mini evergreen is a heaven and earth design and then we have finishing touch and that is from pain free crafts and that was on the uh, Facebook group it was a free pattern in the uh, files in the Facebook group so I need to have a look and see which of those two patterns I started second so uh, so finishing touch was the 13th of April mini evergreen was the 28th of April so with it being random two the second one is mini evergreen so that's what I will be stitching on for this whole week so mini evergreen so uh, we've got five days so one two three four five so we want the went the yeah one two three four yeah I want five full days so we want mini evergreen in there mini evergreen mini evergreen so that's four and the fifth mini 
Evergreen socks. I'm keeping weekends free for any events or stitch alongs, um, things like that. So we then get on to two, three, four, five. So there we want the second whip go, which is number 16. So we need the numbers again. Whoops. So we want the number. one and we want the number six so we've got the number 16 uh yes number 16 and that is random one so random one so like i said that will be another full coverage so the first one was finishing touch and i started that on the 13th april yes 13th of april so we want finishing touch and again we want five days so we want finishing touch finishing Touch. So that is both of the whip goes in. So four and sixteen. So um, I do still like to write in um, when we would have had the diamond painting weekend. I know that that has stopped but I would still like to keep up with it because otherwise I would not get round to diamond painting. So I have got written down the second, third and the fourth. So DP weekend. So there are the second, the third and the fourth. So yes, the Friday I would probably diamond paint up uh, the Friday I will probably work on mini evergreen but that will be during the day so then on the evening when I come up here I will diamond paint and then the same Saturday and the same Sunday um, as you guys know stitch 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 <laughs> so yeah otherwise I wouldn't normally get round to do any diamond painting so i do like to keep myself strict in that way so but like i said they have the diamond painting zoom has since stopped so then we have the the long dog zoom is on the 18th normally it would be the last sunday of the month it would be the 25th but there is something else happening um that weekend for the host that uh, does the long dog zoom uh, they've got something else on so she's changed it to the weekend before the sunday i've got that i've got that so then the uh, cross stitch weekend is the 23rd 24th and 25th so we've got the cross stitch 
weekend so all of that weekend 25 23rd 24th and 25th um, so, yeah right so I've got those written in uh, the 24th there is a new stitch starting blooms in the zoom uh, then the 10th I need to write that in there yep right so right up until <coughs> there so now we need to put the acrostic in so i have got it all planned and the word is happen stance i'm not sure what that means but happen stance yeah happen stance so we need to get the letters so let's get going with these letters so first we have the H whoops I know that doesn't want to come off so I've got the H in here and what did I have for that so I have coffee sampler because it's designed by happy mood point so coffee sampler and that's happy mood point then we want an A so I've put the always and forever that was the uh, magazine uh, by modern folk embroidery so always and forever then we want a p Again, I'm going to leave. I think am I going to leave? No. I think for this last one, I usually do carry on because, yeah, it's usually up to like 14 letters. This time there is only 12. But yeah, for this I include the weekends. So this first P, I have got finishing touch because it's by pain free crafts so, finishing touch and it's by pain free crafts and like i said that was a <coughs> free one on the fat for fabulous designers facebook group then we want another P, another P, oh I've got long dog in there so I can't put, oh can I, that's long dog, yeah because then I'll, if I get any stitching time during the day and the 18th the sunday the 18th is also father's day so yeah let's celebrate all the daddies uh so i have got ocean pearl ocean pearl yeah for the l so got the p there we need an e Oh. 
need an E in there and I've put mini evergreen so mini evergreen what an N this side and we have the coffee sampler again but that is for the letter because it's got an n in the pattern so coffee sampler and then we want an s Put Hello Spring. Hello. Oops. Spring. Then we want a T. And for the T, I have put Finishing Touch. Finishing. Touch. Uh, we have an air again. Oops. And this one is always and forever, and this is out of a Stitch Rovia book. Always and forever. Then we want an N, another N. <clears throat> so for this N, again, I have put coffee sampler for the letter. So coffee. Sampler. Then we want a C. A C. Run in there. And again, coffee sampler for the C. Coffee sampler. And then for the last letter, we want an E. So another E. And that will be the last one. And I have got coffee sampler again. So I'll be working on that quite a lot at the end of this month. So that is again for the letter. So yeah, worked out that. We've done the whip go, which is four and sixteen. Um, so This is currently where we are up to. I'll put that one down. So yeah, that is my stitching plans for June. So yeah, the whip grows were 4 and 16. And again, those are the uh, random uh, the random patterns, random two and random one. And yeah the acrostic so happen stance i don't even know if i'm saying that right but yeah uh last month i did i believe complete my whip go let's just double check so 17 yes we did and five yes we did so yeah so yeah i've got my whip go board so the number four 
there is random 2 and the number 16 down here is random 1. So yeah, that was my Wipgo picks. Um, I don't think there's anything else. Let me just check my notes. Um, no, uh, neither of those apply yet. Of July and of August, so those don't apply yet this month. Um, yeah, I just write little little bits and pieces down and little notes for myself. And if there's any stitch alongs or anything going off. So, yeah, I think that is everything for today. I think that is all of my June stitching plans. So the 1st of July will be a Saturday. So yeah, that should be um, easy enough to film. Um, I'm, I'm filming later on today. Um, so yeah, we're, we're now in the evening time. I do normally film this on an afternoon to get it done during the day and then I've got the evening free, but um, yeah, we've had comings and goings all day today, so I've not been able to film until after tea when I've come up here for my evening time, my chill out. Um, but yeah, that is everything. So I will be working on mini evergreen. I'll keep going with it and see what I can get done this evening um, probably later on I will switch to a smaller project or I may even diamond paint but yeah we'll see what I can get done for the rest of today um, but yeah I'm going to let you guys go so um, yeah have a fantastic rest of your day um, you will see me again <laughs> tomorrow um yeah tomorrow for my uh floss tube so i'll be able to give you an update and where i am on all of my stitching for my uh friday floss tube video and yeah i will um yeah give you guys an update tomorrow on my stitching and what i've been doing so like I said, enjoy the rest of your day. And remember, guys, in a world where you can be anything, be kind. Bye, guys. <laughs>